Og nu går døren op. Og ind kommer Danmarks kommende kongepar. On January 4th, Princess Mary of Denmark got them a cheerful display as she arrived at the Christianborg Palace for a traditional New Year's fête. Walking side by side into the FN, the couple appeared positive as they greeted the officer, representative of major national organization and royal patronages. The outing was Queen Margareta's final public appearance before stepping aside for her son to become king. Crown princess wore her skirt from Brazil Gibertau and her velour jacket from Jasper Hoffring. She commented the look with a piece of jewelry that romantically symbolized her love for her husband, Crown Prince Frederick. The princess wore a so-called dog collar with a five row of pearls and a large aquamarine ring with a sapphire around her neck, which she received from Crown Prince Frederick. The jewelry set also include two set of earrings, some small ear stud and the long one with the large aquamarines. Crown Princess Mary has previously worn during the Greek state visit in 2009. The first time the royal wore the distinguished dog collar was at a dinner with the Australian governor in March 2005. And several times the crown princess wore this jewelry for various other events. On April 17, 2021, the Dungeons of Cambridge Princess Kate attended the funeral of Prince Philip. The princess wore a Roland Maurer dress with an asymmetrical neckline and covered it with an elegant black Catherine Walker coat. Accompanying the look was a Japanese pearl choker necklace, which was worn by Kate for the Queen and Prince Philip's 70th wedding anniversary dinner at Windsor Castle in 2017, and by her late mother-in-law, Princess Diana, in 1982. On this occasion, I would like to compare that the choker worn by Princess Kate is almost similar to the one worn by Princess Mary. It's no surprise that the royal fan called Kate and Mary royal sister. <laughs>